Today's <laughs> cook. What? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's all good. Yeah. You invited this guy. Oh my god, come <laughs> on, you guys. Kidding. Just get in the car. What's up, brother? Gang, What's up, gang. Up, okay, guys, so where should we go? I'm ready to do this. Mm, let's pull up the sort of plastic report. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. Let's see. <laughs> There's a nice little south swell on Ocean Beach. It says there's over 3,000 plastic bottles floating around. Should we check out Pacifica? Mm, even worse, 6,000. What about Rodeo Beach? Oh yeah, maybe we could do that. Mm. No, apparently there's 1,500 plastic bottles and caps floating on the water. I mean, I don't think we can paddle out on that. Wait, I got one. Yeah? Half Moon Bay. Yeah, there's no way. What are you talking about? There's yeah. all these microplastics and synthetic fibers. You know that. Yeah, I'm not trying to get sick again. It's fine. Oh, no, it's can. not Closed fine. Closed mouths. Touch me. We did it last time. OK, well, I don't want to do it this time. It's not going to happen, man. Y'all are lame. You know what? Whatever. We're going to figure it out, OK? I'm getting in the water today. That's happening. It is insane to think that by 2052, there will be more plastic than fish in the ocean. The estimated number of particles in the ocean today ranges from 15 to 51 trillion pieces. And the big problem, which we all should be aware of, is that microplastics ingested by fish and crustaceans can be subsequently consumed by humans. I don't want plastic in my food, so let's not put plastic in the ocean.